Greetings everyone, welcome to my one up and play of Bloody Steel's map 4 and Ultra Violence. This map is called Alarm at the Factory and was submitted by Leon Man. Alright, so yeah, that was a pretty interesting title screen. It kind of looked like, uh, like these Soviet Union posters you would find back in the day. And there's a reason for that. Once we leave this building, we're gonna find out why. But first, we need to get rid of some zombies here. Drop the shotgun, get rid of this missile. Alright. If I stand like here, he will never shoot me, so... Oh, unless I do that. Of course. Alright. Can I grab the shells here? Probably if I make like a jump. Yeah. Alright, so yeah. We got some... Uh, Russian writing on this wall, and this one says, do not put salt on the eggs. Not sure what that means, maybe someone else knows, but uh, it's what it says, according to a reliable source. But yeah, we got some uh, interesting visuals, as you can see, like this is some kind of storage room, like with all kinds of canned food, I think. Not sure I'm using my imagination here, but it looks good. And here we have a stop sign in the middle of a hallway, that's interesting. And if you look carefully, you can see like a wire touching the water. And I believe this water electrifies at some point. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Electrified water. Also this poster here, I believe, this one I didn't get to translate, but I believe it says, like, employee of the month, uh, doom guy or something, I, I'm not sure, I could be wrong about this, someone, uh, I'm sure a Russian speaker that actually can read Cyrillic, unlike me, uh, knows what it says, so if you know what it says, just let me know. Alright, Kako? In this little office. And... Okay, let's go. I believe there's a secret here. Yes. A backpack, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Always nice to have. Alright. Let's get out of here. Through the lift. Get ready for an ambush. Pretty nasty one too. Like, the lights shut off. And then, boo! Chain Gunners! Thankfully only two. It's not like in Hell Reviewed Map 23, where like 10 of them surround you. Alright, um, this door is pretty special. It actually opens up when you reach the exit, so keep a good eye on this one. It uh, brings to a secret area. But yeah, the attention to detail on this map is incredible. Just wait till we get outside. It's really cool looking. Am I ready? Watch this. Yeah, look at that. It's a Soviet Union era factory. Look at this. Just... I've never heard of this world before, but this is really impressive. And I believe this is from like the early 2010s, or not even. It's really impressive. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff to kill here, so let's just walk around a bit. Also got some uh, items to pick up, a lot of snipers. Uh, the right side we're gonna ignore for now. I wanna go kill the hit scanners mostly. Pick up some rockets as well. And also this stim pack. And, we have another secret over here. Supercharge. Let's see, any more hit scanners? Yeah, there they are. Nasty snipers. Alright, let me see. Aims are next. Oh, yeah, there's another writing on the wall here. So yeah, this writing, I believe it says... 
uh, give us beer, not piss. I don't think the factory workers are very happy in this uh, place. Yeah, this tunnel leads to the exit. And I believe you need a red key for it, which you don't have, but it has a super shotgun, which I do want. Makes killing uh, the bigger enemies a bit easier, and especially the pinkies. There's gonna be a lot of pinkies at some point. Killing them with a single hit is always nice. Alright, there's some very annoying chain gunners up there. Hopefully, they will interact with the imps, but I don't think the imps can actually hit them. Like, the angle is... doesn't work out. And... I kinda want shells before I take on these Knights. I don't think they can leave this area, so I'm just gonna move on. Chain gunners appear to be distracted or something? I don't know, but um... Oh, here you are. Alright, there we go. Chain gunners are dead. We also get a plasma rifle over here. So you don't have to go here, because you don't have the red key, but there are some goodies you can grab in the fence, so... There we go. Plasma. Let's kill the killer tomato. And just... Clear out this area, now that we're here, so... Imps go bye-bye, and this Hall Knight... Somehow got there. I think it's the one that's supposed to be around the corner, but I, he saw me somehow. He woke up. Normally he's here. Like, waiting here for you. But he... I don't know, he saw me. So. And yes. You may have noticed it. There was like a red chain gunner armor. At least it uses the chain gunner like colors. Right over here. Look at that. That's the mega armor. Looks a bit different, but it, it's exactly the same as a mega armor. You just gotta drop down like this, and there you go. Alright, so this area is clear. We've got a super shotgun and a plasma, which we can use to kill stuff. So we got more hit scanners on the roof. We got some arachnitrons over here, which I think I'll just plasma. Should I plasma them? No. I wanna save some plasma just in case. There's some tricky fights in this map, so. Also, I'm getting sniped. I think I missed a shotgun or somewhere. Oh, there you are. Great, now I need health, so let's quickly backtrack. Actually, I saw a snip back here. Health, health, health. Health, health, health. There's a lot of health in this tunnel. There we go. And some armor. Oh yeah, and these pinkies. Uh, I don't have shells for them. But I'm sure there was like a... Yeah, there they are. See? There were shells here. There's also like a box of shells somewhere else. I think the box of shells was somewhere here. Was it? No. Or, it was here. Well, no box of shells, but plenty of shells, uh, pickups and shotgunners, so that also uh, works out. Nice jib. Alright, Mancubus. Thank you for killing the shotgunner. And there are some imps, like, behind the structure. A lot of um, stuff to explore in this map, it's really cool. Also, I think there's a revenant here. No, that's a pinky. Lots of stuff to explore and everything looks like... ...realistic almost. But it still looks doomy, so... ...that is really cool. Really well done. Kinda wanna admire the aesthetics a bit, like... You know, normally in real life you... Look at a factory like this, and you're like, oh, that's not pretty at all. But like, if it's done in a video game like Doom, it looks really impressive. Look at that. Maybe I need a, I need a thumbnail. Is this thumbnail worthy? Like here, 
Yeah, this is Thunder Worthy, this is cool. And I really like the skybox as well. It reminds me of the previous um, submission. Another world map 3. Kinda like Dawny. Bit depressing in a way, but cool. Alright, so what do we have here? We have another post there. This one I didn't get to translate because I forgot about it. Sure, I have a lot of Russian viewers, so they know exactly what it says. So, let us know. Show us your Russian speaking skills and reading skills. And let us know what it says, because I don't know. Alright, let's move on. I completely missed that. So did he. Alright, so we need a yellow key for this. The yellow key is down here. And also a rocket launcher and a berserk. But beware, the yellow key is very, very, very booby trapped. With a lot of pinkies. So what I'm gonna do is just get out and not bother with them. Just say goodbye. And just continue. We'll just let everything spawn in later when we have the ammo for it, so we'll just kill them all. Alright. Next area. This is probably one of the more difficult ones, because there is the Revenants. There's one pretty nasty fight coming up with a lot of roaming revenants that can really scam you. Also, we got some sniping hell knights, some indestructible mancubus. But yeah, look at that. Still a lot of enemies to kill. Also, hell knights spawn over here. And don't forget about the secrets. Energy salt pack, I will also kill this guy, because why the hell not? And those hell nuts I'll kill later. I don't think they are really dangerous, so let's just move on. Over here. Let me see, I believe there's a hell knight over here as well. He's guarding a box of shells. Good thing I killed the other hell knights, so he doesn't bother me while I kill this one. Do I need this? I don't know, I'll just grab it. Why not? I don't think there are any hit scanners here, so it's kind of pointless, but um... Let's spice it up a bit. Uh, maybe should switch to something else. Shotgun? No, super shotgun. Never mind, I'll stick to the super shotgun. Plenty of shells in this area. Ow. The Kako chumped me. Alright, what do we have here again? Pain Elemental? Let me get the Plasma for this. Look at my health. My non-existent health. Alright. Was there another Kako or am I imagining things? Oh, yeah, see? I'm not imagining things. Alright, so this area is kind of tricky because of the roaming revenants. There's quite a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of them. Well, I, uh, I don't know what happened there. My tongue didn't want to work anymore. Thank you, Hell Knights. There should be more revenants, but they are not feeling it today. They're not. Uh, their pathing doesn't seem to work today. I'm not complaining. All right. Whoa, block map. Thank you. Thank you for not working. Is that it? I thought there were more revenants here. Also, no, you cannot blow this up. I. It looks like you can, like in Duke Nukem, but no. Alright, so that's this area cleared. Now we can press this switch, which opens up. Uh, this big open area, but for that you gotta backtrack. 
So let's go back and go check it out. Oh, and the Erectron's appeared here. This container open up. I think it's a container. No, it's not. I don't know what it is. I don't know what my imagination is telling me here. It's a concrete open bunker. That's what it is. I don't know. Okay. So I think this uh, that switch opened up the next area. The one before that opened up the, the bunker container thingy mabob. So we go back over here where we killed the, uh, the mancubus. Yeah, so this opened up and here's another fairly tough area. I do need that armor. You know, I think this may be actually the hardest fight in the map. Yeah, so you even get a supercharge, then you know it's uh, serious. Alright, so... I'm gonna prepare the... Mm, rocket launch. I wanna focus on the revenants. I think they all appear in the center. So, what I gotta do is, I gotta press the switch. Where's the switch again? I don't know. Oh yeah, it's here. There it is. Okay, so you press the switch, then focus on the revenants, if they wanna spawn. Yeah, there they are, okay. You die first, you're dangerous. You do 80 damage missiles. That's not cool. Because if you keep the revenants alive, there's gonna be the missiles chasing you. I mean, you cannot really, like, slow down to properly aim at imps, or like, to... Uh, path enemies to a certain direction. You're always on your, like, at a fast pace. But now you can just like slowly strafe to one side, then all the enemies will kind of pile up, and then you just shoot some juicy rockets like that. Except that second one. Also, maybe next time we should kill some of those sniping enemies like with Mancubus. Because they're like... You can kill them from the very start if you want. For some reason, I don't. I guess it spices up the uh, difficulty, so... It's more fun to watch, maybe? I don't know, you tell me. You can also, whoa, just kill them like this, do whatever. Also, you can climb these ladders through some uh, doom magic. For some big ammo packs. And that switch in the center, where the revenants were, that opens up the next area. So let's go do that. I didn't already, and I didn't. All right, so what do we have? Yeah, so this bridge appears. Now I can finally get rid of those sniping revenants, so... Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Didn't die. Now we did. Got some hit scanners here. They go down first. Also, a lot of imps over here. Sh shoot a juicy rocket. And there we go. Actually, I think I'll keep these alive. And I'll keep them alive for one reason. It's gonna be a spider mastermind here soon. And it would be great if she could get distracted by those imps. Sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. Let's find out. Also, we can finally kill these guys. With the proper height for it. There we go. We're getting a lot of rockets. Not gonna use them yet. There's one very pesky Hanite in this map that is really, really difficult to shoot. I don't think he has spawned yet. I think he spawns along with the spider demon. Alright, so this switch spawns the spider demon. I'm just gonna, like, stand here. Is she gonna infight? Yeah. Yeah, boy! Let's go! Oh, she killed the uh, imp already. Okay, then I'll keep my distance. It scan cannot hit me here, so... Haha. <laughs> okay, this should be enough to kill her. Yeah. Cool. So yeah, not a very threatening uh, spider demon. But honestly, her being threatening is kind of uncommon. Or no. Yeah, it is uncommon. 
proper Spider-Man usage is uh, kind of difficult sometimes. But yeah, as you can see, there are two Hell Knights on those two huge chimneys up there. I'm not sure if you can... Yeah, there's one on the right. It's hard to see because they don't show themselves. But yeah, one of them, the one on the right side that's kind of visible, is easy to kill because that's a secret area. The one on the left is an absolute pain in the butt. I think there's only like one spot you can shoot him from because he's very high up. Uh, the angle is very steep so your auto aim doesn't reach. Except for one place which I will show uh, towards the end. I still need to um, kill some enemies and get the red key. So the red key we saw over here and to get there. Oh wait, this guy spawned. Yeah, so these stairs appeared, I think, after pressing that switch um, that spawned the spider demon. Then you just gotta follow uh, the bad level design arrows. Yeah, this level's got arrows in it. Bad level design. And yeah, you just go up this building, kill some more hit scanners. Don't forget the armor. Some more hit scanners up there. There we go. Alright, so this switch allows you to do some parkour. To where the shotgunners are, so you just do a, a big jump like this. We go over here, and from here you can jump to the red key. There you go. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna quickly heal up. Just to be safe. There should be a medikit here somewhere. Or not. Okay. Guess I wasted them. Um, one secret left. It's right at the end. Kind of. Oh no, it's the, it's the secret that I mentioned at the start. Like, the door that you need to keep an eye on. Um, yeah, these Arkham Johns also spawn along with the Spider Mama. Oh yeah, and I still gotta kill all the pinkies. Oh man, there's so much stuff to do. But at least we got the big guns, this shouldn't be too hard. I will uh, unlock the last secret. For that I need to open up the elevator to the exit. But first, it's time for some boom magic. It's gonna be some fake room over floor, uh, room over room floors here. As you can see this is a spiral staircase, kind of. See? It's magic. If you're curious how that is done, it's done through silent teleporters. If I show the automob, you can see how it works. So there's a very uh, uncanny, high quality poster here. Compared to the rest of the textures, this is really high quality. Uncanny. Anyway, let's uh, press some switches here. And I will show the automob to show you how the spiral staircase works. It's just a bunch of silent teleporters. So. As you can see, it teleports me to, like, the next area. See? The silent teleporters. It's an ancient trick, but it works. Also, it's open, but also, we got two Archfoss. And we don't want them to resurrect the Baron at all. No, you don't. So yeah, that's the exit. We don't go there yet because we still have some enemies to kill. And we have the secret to check out. And I will check out the secret first because it gives a megasphere. So let's go back to the beginning area. Right over here. And as you can see, this door is now open, which is the final secret. Here you can find that pesky Hell Knight that was trying to snipe us. And we can admire the skybox a bit. But yeah, we still gotta kill that other Hell Knight on the other side of the of the chimney. Or whatever this is. It's not a chimney. Tower. Structure. Hi tall structure. But yeah, that Hell Knight I will kill later. First, we gotta kill all the binkies. Oh, and those Hell Knights too. Do I have the ammo for this? Maybe. 
I think I didn't go here yet. Did I? Did I grab the boxes of ammo? Yes, I did. Okay. Um, I guess I'll punch out the pinkies just to save ammo, because I need ammo for that Hell Knight up there. You cannot shoot him from here. Like I said, the angle is too steep. So, I guess we're gonna play some punch outs. Always fun. And I still gotta kill those Hell Knights. Oh man. I mean, I can kill him with plasma, but I just wanna play it safe. I don't wanna, like, run out of ammo. I'm pretty sure I, there's a lot of ammo still to be picked up. I just cannot be bothered to look for it, so. Punch out it is. Yeah, I think I'll use my chain gun. No, I use my. I think I'll use my plasma to kill, like that hell knight that is trying to shoot at me. I honestly think there's an ammo stash somewhere that I forgot about because I never ran out of ammo at this point. I don't know what happens. And yeah, this is a boom map, as I uh, mentioned during the staircase uh, magic. I would almost say this is like a UDMF map, like how well the architecture is. And the skybox being high quality, really could be like a GC Doom thing, but nope, this is boom. It's really impressive, and it's not, it's pretty... Well, it's not, I wouldn't say old, but it's not recent or anything. So yeah, uh, plasma, I'll use the... Plasma. Should I be used plasma? Because they move around. Ah, oh, screw it. Chain on this. Or hell. Since I'm relatively close to them, let's just snipe them with the shotgun. Just to play it safe. Alright, there should be one enemy left here. Somewhere. Is that a pink I didn't kill? Oh, no, wait, 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 it's the Hell Knight, of course. So yeah, uh, this map has six broken uh, spawners. So six enemies will never spawn in, unfortunately. But I will still try to go for the theoretical, or like, max skills possible, which is 365. And for that you need to kill this pesky Hell Knight. And yeah, it's really tough to aim at him, because... Like, you can see him from here, but he's too far away. You cannot, it's like 1,024 units. Uh, your auto aim of that range doesn't reach him. So what you gotta do... Well, not that. This is the only spot I could find where you could shoot him. Because from below, the angle is too steep. But from here... You can actually hit him. And the reason I saved on plasma, so you, so you can see, like... The projectiles go up. Yeah, see? I think this is, like, right at the... Come on. Yeah, there we go. And then that's when I run out. Okay, rockets then. Come on. Hit him. Hit him. Hit him. No. Okay. Chain gun then. He's hit. As long as I don't see the puffs on the wall, I should be hitting him. I'm just looking at the kill count while I shoot. 364. Yes! Got him! Yeah! Yeah, that's a really stupid kill. But uh, he's dead. Can I see his corpse? Can I...? Not really. But he's dead for sure, I promise. I really cannot see the corpse. Nope, I don't know where he died, but he's dead. 365, that's the max amount of kills you can get. Well, let's just move on, let's go exit. But the six enemies that you cannot kill, I think it's like four imps, two revenants or something, or two imps, two pinkies, two revenants. They're supposed to spawn in like at the entrance of that building right there, if I remember correctly. I'm not entirely sure, but they never wake up. Like there's no sound propagation to that area, so they always uh, stay asleep. And they're all the teleporters they're standing on causes them to get stuck in the ceiling so they can't even move even if they did wake up so yeah bit of a shame but 
what the hell this is a really cool map uh, you can actually see it there at the bottom left of the intermission screen i just noticed but yeah all of these maps in this world i think it has 10 maps if i remember correctly or maybe less but um all of them are like this kind of time travel slash soviet union factories or mansions uh, kind of maps it is really cool and i honestly never heard of this before and was a very pleasant surprise and yeah we've got some very cool gopnik music going on hell yeah but yeah that's uh that's bloody steel so if you want to check it out it's in the description hope you enjoyed the video and thank you very much leon man for the submission it was really cool and uh yeah thanks for sharing and see you all next time